What's happening, everyone? Welcome to G-Ball Vision. Today, I have an unboxing to do for you guys. And before you get any thoughts, this isn't just any old unboxing. This is going to be one of the most anticipated knives for the channel, for me, for the year. I have waited months and months close to a year to get this knife in hand on the table uh, I saw this knife before I even started my channel and I knew that I wanted it then uh, they were very hard to get they did not come in stock as far as I know about a month ago month and a half ago they went into stock and that was the first time within the last year that they were in stock and then I waited another month for it to get from overseas to California and customs to get into USPS's hands and then go from California to Pennsylvania. So it was over a month that I waited for this guy. We'll go ahead and use the brand new Vosteed Gator. If you didn't see the unboxing, I will link a card up here on the top right hand corner if you wanna go check out the unboxing. But spoiler alert, guys, if you like bigger knives, this thing is a beast. It's like nine and a quarter, I believe. We'll do an in-depth overview of it and all that sort of thing coming up. But 14C, 28N, look at that thing. Coming down on a hollow grind there, just slicey as all hell. I mean, it is unbelievably slicey. Dual thumb studs front flipper rear flipper frag micarta deep carry reversible pocket clip copper pivot collar this is a winner and you might be saying is that like 150 dollars 200 dollars no guys 70 bucks that is amazing and they did two different blade shapes i opted for this one because it just looks phenomenal the sheep's foot looks good too, but not anywhere close to as good as this one, in my opinion. So, enough blibbity blabbity. Let's get into this guy. I am stoked. Here we go, guys. Here we go, baby. Waited all this time. All this time. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, and now it's making sense to you. You're saying, oh, that's why he waited a month. Yes, a Kun Wu, guys. And uh, that's all that's in the package for my curious people who... Uh, why didn't you show everything in the, the mailer? Well, that's all that was in the mailer, guys. Just the box. So it, it comes sealed up in plastic wrap there. And then you get a nice looking box here. This is my first Kun Wu. This is my first experience with Kun Wu. Never held one, never handled one. Only ever saw them in videos. So you have a magnetic enclosure here. Oh, I am so excited. You get a nice little canvas baggie here, a little drawstring baggie nice you get a, a Kun Wu certificate of authenticity card you get a cleaning cloth and a Celica packet you get some extra hardware it looks like and there she is guys 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 Yes. Look at this thing. It's got like an orange peel finish to it. Can you see that? Oh. Guys, this is coming in Vanex Super Clean. What do you think it is? Let's open her up. Oh. So this is the Sheep's Foot 
cow, guys. Look at that thing. Oh, guys. Oh, frame lock. Yes, you can thumb flick it. Yes. Look at that. Rear flipper's good. Front flipper is good. Reverse flick is good. This is badass. Perfect size. Nice thin blade stock. Feels pretty thin. That is a mean looking sheep's foot. Look at that orange peel. That is awesome. You got Kun Woo's imprint there, lasered in. You got their logo on the pivot there. Is that Zerku tie? They got freaking Zerku tie or or no, is that Tamascus? Is that a Tamascus pivot collar? Whew. Reversible clip, wire clip. I wonder if that can be changed. Anyone know? Leave it down in the comments. Let me know. And while we're talking about comments, why don't you, uh, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. It's free. <laughs> hit the thumbs up, too, while you're down there. This thing is awesome. I have waited a year, basically, to get this. And, and they didn't make it any easier by making me wait a month to get it from China. Uh, I was not real enthused about ordering from Kunwu, knowing that it took several weeks. I've heard 10 days to 30 plus days. So I bought it hoping it would be, you know, the 10 to 14 days type of deal. Well, I think it went about the max that it does because uh, it took at least 30 days. There you got the Vanex on the clip side. S Tau. What do they got? So this is a machine satin. Looks very well done. So let's let's settle down and regroup here. So you have a machined satin Vanex Super Clean sheep's foot blade you have what i would call a superman hole you have a front flipper and a rear flipper so tons of deployment methods you can thumb flick it out reverse flick it out front flipper works great rear flipper works great you have I'll have to get some clarification on that. What do they got there? Oh, they give you... What is that? Oh, those are blue barrel spacers. Oh! I might put those in. They give you an extra pocket clip for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe they've had issues with it in the past or something. I was trying to see if that's Tamascus or Zerkutai. If somebody knows, leave it down in the comments because it looks like... Boy, I don't know. It kind of looks like it's Tamascus or Zerkutai. I bet that's Tamascus. Uh, that's what it looks like anyway. It looks like, ooh, it got me. Or something opened up on my nails. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry. Sorry about that. So, 
you have T6 on the lock bar screw, which I have no idea why they did that. And then they did They did T8 on everything else. I'm just making sure everything's tight. That's something that I typically do off camera, like after the video. But it's nice to know that a company, you know, everything's tight, everything's good, that sort of thing. So you have T8 all the way around, except for that lock bar screw, which you ain't really gonna mess with that anyway. So that is a T6. She is nice and centered, looks good. Blade to handle ratio looks good. That is a clean, clean looking design, if I might say so myself. All the Kun Woos look good. This is the one that caught my eye the most. There is one more that's got like a... Uh, crossbar style lock i think it's one of their their newer models but coming in the vanax with that sheep's foot blade uh the size that it is this is in my wheelhouse uh this thing is phenomenal there will definitely be a full overview full review maybe we'll do a disassembly of this guy tons of stuff coming up on this guy if you're still here thank you i love you if you're still here and you're not subscribed hit the subscribe button down below the video i would love to have you here hit the thumbs up button leave me a comment down below do you have any kun woos do you want to get a kun woo are you a kun woo i don't know you let me know down below uh i am definitely kun woo for sure uh I like this guy a lot and you will be seeing plenty more of it i gotta get going i have a live stream we gotta cut this one short uh monday nights at 5 15 eastern saturday mornings at 11 15 a.m eastern be there or be square love y'all catch you on the next one